are starting Red's talk number two. Today we are missing um, Josh Janfell, who is our also our host of Red's talk. Today we're missing him, but I can do it alone. So first of all, we're going to talk about our past games. Now we haven't had a lot actually, but we our team, the Thornhoveds, have just won a St. Thomas tournament. That was in number one. We were in St. Thomas in the tournament. You didn't get to see any of those games, sadly. Uh, Max Lard makes an amazing diving catch, and they win that tournament. Gold medalists, 18 teams. Not only that, but beating every team, almost mercying every team. So, um, on this version of Red Sox, we're also going to be talking about the stats. Cole Rutman, in their last game against the North Toronto A's, hit a home run. Now, their bats were moving, and they mercy them 18 to nothing in the third inning, and Josh Denfall only had to throw... 35 pitches to get them out of that whole game. Now, if you come with me, this is the medal that the Thornhill Reds got in St. Thomas. You can see St. Thomas champions, mosquito champions. Okay, now we can go back to the studio. Also, in their next games coming up, they have a few games and then a Cambridge tournament. So here the information is that when they go to Cambridge, they will be having home run derbies, all-Star Game, and a pitching contest, and there will be a ballad under to vote. Um, under this video, you can comment below, and people will follow up with your opinion. It's just an All-Star Ballad, pitching ballad, say whoever you want. If you know the players, watch the other videos. The Reds this year are going to lots of different cities to do anything. Now, what I have here is that the Reds going to Cambridge is going to be a lot harder than St. Thomas, and they're going to have a lot more. Max allard has been using the bats. Josh Dimfell moves him up to the second spot from the seventh spot. Benji Litz hasn't been hitting amazing, but he's still sticking there in the third spot. Now, the information I have here, also more stats here is that Cole Weinberg has also been hitting, so the team has been hitting well. The defense needs to improve, and they will be keep working. That's it for Red's talk. Oh, and one more thing. With the free agency signing, breaking news for the Reds. Brit, uh, a few weeks ago, the Reds just signed a free agent, Brandon Bruno, to the team. Out of free agency, and it's a surprising one. Let's see how Brandon Bruno starts off his hitting. He hit, he had a 325 average with 70 at-bats and only struck out seven times. But that is in select. He's a prospect. We'll see how he turns out to be. They just signed him out of free agency. We'll see how it turns out. He's a great hitter. And we'll see how that turns out. That's all for Red's Talk today. You can subscribe to us. And we'll see you next time.